Hey guys, Marsh from the Trump here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be opening all four of these tournament packs 17. Uh, they literally came out like this week, and uh, yeah, I'm just going to be getting into them. Uh, I just went into a tournament and I traded for three, and I got my own for entry. Um, there are three cards per pack, and as you can see, they are not open, so uh, let's see if we can get anything good. Um, because of the way I'm filming, I will have to pause and then open the pack and then pull the cards out. So, uh, let's get into it. So, in the first pack, just open that now. Let's see what we get. Card 1. We get Yazi, Evil of the Yang Zing, a Synchro. That's actually really cool. And I, uh, I quite like the artwork on that one, so that's awesome. Oh, nice. I, I actually really wanted this. Insector Dragonfly. I think I only got one copy from um, the old Zexal packs from 2011. So uh, that is great to have a second copy. And finally, I'm looking at it through the camera, so I'm seeing what you're seeing. I see a spell. Flawless Perfection of the Tenyi. That, that, the artwork's cool. I don't run Tenyi. So, I'm not sure if that's even useful to me. Probably not, but nevertheless, it looks cool. Right, moving on to pack two. So, in pack two, let's see what we get. Uh, it'd be kind of cool to get some penguins and maybe Outstanding Dogmaron, because I do run uh, penguins with my frog deck, and uh, Outstanding Dogmaron is kind of cool. Well, we did actually get a penguin, so I can't complain with that. Penguin Soldier. Um... I mean, it is Penguin Soldier, so I probably won't run many or any, but um, he's looking awesome, and <laughs> he's a great classic card that Joey used, so you can't complain there. Oh! <laughs> Outstand Outstanding Dog Maron. This is a bit weird. Uh, so, yeah, if you don't know... Ooh, that's nice. If you don't know, uh, basically it just never disappears. It just keeps going back into your deck. Uh, it's quite cool. I don't actually want it to use it, I just like the card, and I like those Mecha Dogmaron, School Dogmaron. So, Outstanding Dogmaron is really cool. And yeah, finally, Power Bond. This is really cool. Uh, I did get a couple copies of the uh, new Cyber Strike deck, so that's really cool. And uh, I can add Power Bond into it, which is awesome. Power Bond's obviously already in it, but this is a Tournament Pack Super Rare, so it looks really nice. Uh, the camera's not doing it justice, but, uh, yeah. Really happy with that, actually. It's one of the ones I really wanted. Obviously, any ultimate rare would be great. Um, most wanted, uh, Utopia. However, I'd be really happy with, uh, Infinite Impermanence or the Blackluster Soldier, but, uh, Utopia's the one I'm after. However, someone at the tournament did pull Utopia, so... Either I don't think I can get it, or at least my chances are really low. Okay, so I just open this up. Let's see what's inside. Again, penguins would be nice. Oh, okay. Well, cards are stuck. Hang on. Right, so we got the uh, Yazi Evil Eye. Oh, no, not Evil Eye. What am I saying? Evil of the Yang Zing. Uh, again, it's cool. I'm not sure if anyone I know runs Yang Zing, and I know I don't, so I don't know how useful two are, but I'll take it. Next up we have Dark Simorg. Ah, that, that's actually really cool. Um, I'm not sure how good of a card it is. I do like uh, just Simorg, though, so uh, at the very least it looks cool. And, uh, oh, is that, is that a dupe? Yes, it is. So, uh, a second copy of Flawless Perfection of the Tenyi, which is a, a bit of a bummer. I would have rather, if I was going to get a dupe, it'd be Power Bond, but oh well. I mean, I'm going to be getting a bunch of these packs because it's the newest one, and obviously if I go to tournament every week, I'm getting at least one every week. Right, let's move on to the last pack. Obviously, it's only four packs. I doubt I'll get an ultimate rare, but you never know. It'd be really nice to get one. Okay, so let's see what's in here. I just popped it open, but I've not seen the cards yet. Let's try doing this one-handed. Oh, that looks new. Wait, what was that? 
uh, SZW Fenrir Sword. That's really cool. A Utopia card. I do actually run Utopia in my heroes. Hopefully, if anything, this is a sign that uh, I'm going to get Ultimate Rare Utopia. That'd be really nice, but I'm just wishing there. Uh, what is this? Utopian Aura. So, another Utopia card. To be honest though, I don't think many of the Utopia support cards are that good. It's mainly just the ve um, variations of the Xyz monster that are good. But uh, nevertheless, they're always cool. They're nice to get, and I don't know, some of these newer ones might actually be good. Especially if they're getting reprint. Oh! Then <laughs> that's actually really cool. Super rare Penguin Brave. If I'm not mistaken, I think this is the highest rarity it's ever been printed in. I might be mistaken though, I just know in the tins it wasn't this rare. It actually looks really nice, and again, a penguin card is more than welcome in my Paleo Frog Penguin deck. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> I really like that actually. Um, and that'll fit in nicely with my frogs and my penguins. So, that was it. The four packs have been opened. Um, the pulls were alright. Obviously, the two tenny spell cards wasn't the greatest, but it looks cool. I'm very happy with the Penguin Brave, very happy with Power Bond, and Outstanding Dog Maron was probably my favourite common. Um, let me know what you guys think of this uh, new tournament pack 17. Uh, next week, I might get three more. So, uh, I guess let me know if you want to see another short opening video of three more tournament pack 17s. And, uh, yeah, have a great day. See ya.